Hello kids, welcome to Kido8. Today we are going to learn abacus and place value of three digit numbers. Okay, let's start. First of all, what is an abacus? An abacus is a tool used to learn numbers and place values. Okay, it has beats that represents ones, tens and hundreds. Okay kids. Now, here is the example one. Here, what is the number we are taking? 325. Okay, how to write? 3 hundreds plus 2 tens plus 5 ones is equal to 325. Now, in that hundreds place, how we can write in shortcut form? H. In the tens place T and ones place O. Okay. Now let's draw the abacus. Here is the we are taking three lines because it's a three digit abacus. And in that hundreds place, how many beads we should draw? Three. Because in the hundreds place, what is the number? Three is there. One. 2, 3, here is the 3 and in the tens place how many beads you should draw? 2 because in the tens place number 2 is there 1 and 2 ok in the tens place number 2 is there and one in the ones place how many beads you should draw? 5 ok because in the ones place, what is the number? 5. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Okay. Here is the 5. Okay, kids. Next example. Here we are taking 704. How to write in the expanded form? Seven hundreds plus zero tens plus four ones. Okay, what is the place value of seven? Seven hundred. What is the place value of zero? Zero tens. What is the place value of four? Four ones. Here is the abacus. Here in that hundreds place, how many beads you should draw? 7 because what is the hundreds digit? 7 is there. Okay, let's count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. In the hundreds place, 7 is there. And in the tens place, how many beads you should draw? Zero means nothing. And in the ones place, how many beads you should draw? Four. Because in the ones place, four is there. Let's count one, two, three and four. Okay. This is the 704. Now, it's a practice time. Here I am giving 452 number. You should draw the abacus. Okay, take the paper and pencil. And I am giving 30 seconds time. Time starts now. Is it done kids? Okay, I will tell. Here is the three lines. Hundreds, tens and ones. And in that hundreds place, how many beads you should draw? Four. Because in the hundreds place, what is the number? Four. Let's count one, two, three, and 4. Okay. 
and in the tens place how many beads you should draw five because in the tens place what is the number is there five let's count one two three four and five next in the ones place how many beads you should draw two because in the ones place what is the number is there two let's count one and two okay see here is the 452 number how to draw abacus and what they are asking how many hundreds how many tens and how many ones there in the number four hundreds plus five tens and two ones okay kids now it's a another problem to do here i am giving 520 okay again i am giving 30 seconds time time starts now is it done kids okay i will tell here we are taking three lines because it's a three digit number in that hundreds place how many beads you should draw five because in the hundreds place what is the number is there five okay let's count one two three four and five okay and in the tens place how many beads you should draw two see in the tens place here number two is there let's count one and two in the ones place how many digits are there zero means here no beads okay kids this is the 520 abacus and what they are asking what are the hundreds tens and ones places now here is the five hundreds plus two tens plus zero ones okay kids what is the number 520 I hope everyone understood this video. Well done. Today you did good job. What you learned today? You learned abacus and place value. Okay. Keep practicing. Here is the smiley ball for you. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.